Hey Pixel people, Professor Pixel is back with another Pixel Flix tutorial covering pixel art animation basics in Photoshop on using moving parts. One method for animating your pixel art is by splitting it into movable parts. A very basic example would be this simple stick figure. To split it into parts, first select the marquee tool and click and drag to select an area like the stick figure's head. If you want to select more, hold down shift and click and drag with the marquee. If you select more than you want and need to get rid of some of your selection, hold down Option or Alt and click and drag with the marquee to deselect the area you want. When you have what you want selected, copy it, delete it, and paste it. Your selection will appear on a new layer, like the stick figure's head, which I'm going to rename Head by going under the Layer drop-down window to Layer Properties. Now, with the Move tool and new layer selected, you can move it where you want. With the arrow keys, I'm going to press down to put the stick figure's head back onto the top of its body for the first frame. Now I'm going to make a second frame by going to the animation drop down menu and select new frame. With the second frame and head layer selected, I'm going to move it down one pixel with the move tool so it's up in frame 1 and down in frame 2. When I click the play button, you can see the stick figure's head bob up and down. You can do this with all the body parts like I have here with the body, head, left and right arms, and left and right legs. I made 8 frames and moved each part in each frame so the stick figure will do a little dance. Another example would be this little daredevil I did and split up his arms, head, body, and legs into movable parts. I made a simple three-frame animation and moved the parts to give him a quick fighting idle stance. I split this ghoul pixel art into parts of its stationary body, the arms behind it, the head in front, and the jaw on the layer below the head, so the head can overlap it when it moves up and down. It has a little more complex nine-frame animation, where its arms, head, and jaw all move. One last example would be this Kirby pixel art that I split into parts of his feet, body, face, and upper lip. I put that layer on top of his face so his mouth could open and close. I made a fairly simple six frame animation and moved his parts slightly from frame to frame to give him a subtle, idle animation. Check out some of these Pixel Flix tutorials if you need to get caught up on pixel art or animation basics. And those are the basics of using moving parts to animate in Photoshop. If you have any questions, feel free to message me or drop a comment below. Thanks for watching. Click the annotations for more Pixelflix tutorials. Please like, share, and subscribe. There are new videos every Friday, plus bonus videos.